Oh, yeah. Uh, Anything for my best friend Squidward. Can I rub some on? Uh, what if I just gave you this? Did you find my lost sock? Not yet, Patrick. Oh. Did SpongeBob, this flapping robot crisis is making the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. No money means no more Krusty Krab. No more Krusty Krab means no more fry cooking for you. No more fry cooking? But because you're gullible, I'm gonna help you out. And of course, make a small profit in return. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny objects. First, those stupid robots ruined a perfectly relaxing mud bath this morning. And now you show up. Can my day get any more dreary? I am so sorry, Squidward. Patrick and I were just playing a game and- Oh, I correct myself. I should have known that whole robot problem involved both of you. Squidward, I don't know what to do. How can I fix everything? Why don't you move to another town? That should help out more than enough. Ha, <laughs> ha, move to another town. Ha, I crack me up. <laughs> but seriously, just jump around like an idiot. That should at least make me smile. I didn't know Squidward had a lamp. I didn't know Squidward had a lamp. Downtown Bikini Bottom, once a bustling metropolis, now a debris-covered crater. SpongeBob, the robots are destroying Downtown Bikini Bottom. We have to evacuate! All right, but it's going to take a while to get all this dust. Not vacuum, evacuate! We have to get everyone to safety. Can we just load them up in the boats? That won't do any good. Why not? Because the robots have taken all the steering wheels. Couldn't we just drive in a straight line? No, there are too many turns. Those fiends, they thought of everything. Never fear, Mrs. Puff, I'll get those steering wheels back. SpongeBob, if you're involved, I always fear. But I tell you what, if you can pull this off, I'll give you a golden spatula. How about a driver's license instead? Nice try. It shines! Opening presents.
I'm Rollerific. around town. Fresh like a spring breeze. Bringing it around town. Feel like like a spring breeze. door is locked from the inside. Who would do such a thing? Roll, roll, roll the sponge. Hey, you! Patrick needs to do laundry.
Uh, hi, Gary. Meow? Yes, thanks for noticing. I have been working out. Meow. Not done? Doesn't that mean... Meow. Oh, that's the entrance to the rooftops which leads to the lighthouse? Aha! Uh -huh. There's another golden spatula. I... Meow. What do you mean, get Sandy to help me? <sighs> I can get through this. Meow, meow. Oh, that gap looks big. Okay, I'm definitely not making that jump. How is anyone going to get across there? Uh-oh, more robots. Holy Dutchman's ghost! That gap looks impossible! And impassable! Okay, okay, I'll go get Sandy to help me out. Larry, what's shaking? Sandy! Boy, am I glad to see you. I need your help. My TV reception has been terrible lately. I need to have someone replace my old antenna with this shiny new one. Yes, sir. That there antenna is shinier than a $3 bill. Well, why don't you replace it yourself? I'm not really much of a jumper. So, what's jumping got to do with it? Because the old antenna is up there. Woo! That's taller than a glass of Texas iced tea. The robots have blocked off that building, and I can't do all those fancy moves you and SpongeBob do to get across these gaps. All I can do is flex! Wanna see? Yeah, great. Uh, so what are you gonna do with the old antenna? Oh, that? It's yours if you replace it with a new one. Well, I have been getting bad TV reception in the tree dome.
Someone better make good use of all these. Unless varmint feeling refreshed. Where?